Well, if you ask me, there must be a better way to paint a house. Or at least a way that's lots of fun, A.B. Max, you're making a mess. Now let's keep you busy with something else. Now will this new toy keep you happy? Da da doo goo goo ga ga. <laughs> Have fun, little fella. How cool! A dragon! I'm gonna call him Stitches. I wish he could really fly. How about it, FX? Whatever you say, Max. Yeah, I don't know if... Rocket and roll! Max, will you please control your dragon? Aw, uh, he's so trouble, A.B. Uh-oh! Zoe, get off that ladder before you get hurt! Uh-oh! Dumb old Zoe's gonna blow the whistle! Unless we act fast! Yeah. No! What in blazes? <laughs> Perhaps the 20th century just isn't ready for a dragon. And that proves it. Zoe! Daddy would like to have a few words with you. Max, this is hardly the time for fun and games. We gotta take Stitches someplace safe, right? And what would be safer than in the past? FX, zap us up a time machine. Rocket and roll! Come on, guys! It's time to turn back the clock! <laughs> Get off of my pinta or I hurt to your face. Daddy's diapers. That's Christopher Columbus. Very good, Max. And according to your history lessons... We stayed in the ocean blue. And it's 1492. A plus, Maxwell. Hey, didn't you hear what I said? Get off of my pinta. A.B., how much would you say this time machine weighed? Uh, with or without the dragon. Yeah! Come back here! Where in the hole do you think you're going? Oh, when I get my hands on you! We're in hot water now! Get us out of here, FX! Guess my powers don't work in the past, Max. Maybe we don't need your powers. Look there, Crystal Buddy! Starboard side! Poker near the teepee! Mamma mia! It's Southern the World! And it looks just like the travel brochures! And thanks, Akito! And the how! Glad we could help, Chris! On with the adventure, guys! Hang on! <laughs> Looks like a nice place for stitches. Yeah, but where are we? There's someone we could ask. <sighs> <sighs> Hurry, we're late. Troy is scheduled to fall within a day, and we still have 1,000 Greek warriors to sneak inside. Hey, mister! Hail, tiny stranger. I am Achilles, Greek warrior and architect of Troy's downfall. Is this a safe place for dragons? Who cares about dragons? I've got a battle to win. And that is how I'll do it. It will go down in history as the Trojan Bullfrog. Yeah. Didn't like it, huh? Oh, everyone's a critic. Now we've gone and screwed up history, Max. Leave it to me, A.P. Hey, Achilles. Ever think of building a Trojan horsey? 
a horsey. Hmm, now that's an idea. How brilliant of me. Come, Loquacious, we've got no time to lose. How do you like that? Achilles didn't even help us. What a deal. Good luck, Whoa, let's get out of here! <laughs> this looks like a happening place for a dragon. Here you go! Here you go! Whoa! Enough with the dairy product stitches! Just my tin shots. I'm such a klutz. There he is! Over there! <laughs> oh! Many thanks, Sir Tot. Because of your gallantry and that of your fine steed, I will be able to complete my quest. You have a quest? What kind? The kind that will rid the land of a terrible menace. I'm searching for the answer to the very, very big riddle. And what's that? What opens and closes and has gobs of teeth? Hmm. Got me. Listen, we're looking for cheap lodgings. Any motels around here? Ah, you seek Frankfurt Kingdom. Travel past the Oak of Oran through the parapets of Peril. Then hang a left at Wally's Greasy Cafe. Thanks, Mr. Knight. Oh, no. My humble thanks to you, Sir Tot. If you ever need a favor, just ask, and it will be done. Oh. 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 We shouldn't have stopped at Wally's Greasy Cafe. Oh, finally, we've arrived. Then again, Max... Perhaps we should go back to Wally's for seconds. Hey, the wizard or the dragon will come! Ah! Dragon's happy! Ah! Dragon's happy! Ah! Excellent, merchant. Your fire insurance is paid in full. The Frankfurt dragon is pleased. What are you trying to pull, lady? Aha! I knew it! Pumpernickel bread! <laughs> What's my name, lady? Pumpernickel, my lord! And what bread did my mother feed me every day of my miserable life? Uh, raisin bread, my lord? No! Pumpernickel bread! I hate pumpernickel bread! So does he! The Frankfurt Dragon! And you know what the dragon does to pumpernickel givers, lady? First, your fire insurance is cancelled. Then he swoops down from his mountain perch for a little barbecue. Ah, barbecue! Ah. <laughs> Max, I believe I see some kindly medieval villagers ahead. Excuse me, mister. We're looking for lodging. Some place that would allow a dragon. Dragon? Ah! Dragon! Dragon! Dragon? What are you ninnies talking about? I think they're talking about us, sir. But Stitchy wouldn't hurt anyone. Why, he wouldn't hurt a fly. Don't believe him, my fellow Frankfurters. The Frankfurt Dragon could turn and swoop down and do, oh, oh nasty, nasty things. <laughs> but Stitches loves people. Come on out, kindly medieval villagers. Don't be afraid. Certainly a step closer. He loves people. Well done. Only I can save you. Remember, load the scales and save your tails. Pay, pay, pay me. <laughs> Yuck, dragon breath. Get away from me. See, everyone? Stitch is really is friendly. Ah, oh. 
My costume! Oh. So, young squire, you've got my job, my prestige, my neat wizard's hat. <laughs> but not for long. Pumpernickel will whiz again. Whiz again! Whiz again! <laughs> Did you see that, Blackie? Ah. The new wizard has revealed his weakness. Psst, dragon, got some milk and cookies for you. <laughs> ah, I have you, you scaly nuisance. <laughs> Max, we really should be getting back for your afternoon nap. Have you seen Stitches? Fire! Help! The Frankfurt Dairy is aflame! Let's help out, guys! Dirty diapers! Ah! See, fellow Frankfurters? You can kiss the rest of our kingdom goodbye if you leave this little faker in charge of the dragon. I'll gladly take my old job back if you wish. Stitches wouldn't do this. He's a party animal, not a flamethrower. Pick up! Pick up! Make me your wizard and kiss your dragon fears goodbye. My, my, what a fickle lot. Hey, uh, uh, the dragon's closed. Are you sure you don't want to reconsider this? It might hurt your kingdom's four-star rating. You haven't seen the last of us, Pumpernickel. Have a lovely flight. Asic bags available upon request. Yeah! No one disturb me, man or beast. Did anyone get that catapult's license? Now what do we do? We break out a secret weapon. A bonus for my visit with Columbus. A fish? That's disgusting, even for you, Max. Okay, then. Next time you wear the soggy diaper for two acts. Come on, here's the plan. <laughs> Excellent work, Blackie. As long as we keep the dragon fires burning, the Frankfurters will never again question me as their wizard. <laughs> and with the king away, we'll soon turn the entire castle into one big timeshare condo. Timeshare condo! No down, no down! Now, what to do with him? He could ruin everything if he escapes. One side, buddy, coming through. Got a lot of pizza to give you, but Lord Pumpernickel. Duh, no way. Pizza hadn't even been invented yet. Keep talking, bub. The pizza will get cold, and it's his favorite. Mm. Pepperoni, mushroom, and cheese with fish heads on the side. The fishies? I just love those. I was hoping you'd say that. Well, okay, I'll let you... Uh... Good night! Now to get Stitches. There he is. Stitches! Stitches, everything's gonna be cool now. Perhaps we shouldn't jump to conclusions. How could you trick people into thinking a dragon lives there? Easy. Greed, power, you know the usual villain reasons. Then you boobs show up and almost ruin my brilliant scheme. You won't get away with it. There's gotta be someone more powerful than you. You mean the king? <laughs> I've already taken care of him. He'll return nevermore! 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 Ah! 
He's off wandering around trying to solve a stupid riddle. And now I'll take care of you in Papa Nickel's penthouse playroom. No, yeah! oh, heights make me dizzy. Can we go down now? Of course not, you foolish knave. You'll spend the rest of your days up here playing while I'm out bilking the peasants. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Bilking! <laughs> I've been giving you one around before, but this is too much. Oh, this is the last time I do my own stunts for this show. Yeah! Up the nickel and back! Release the balloons! Let's party! Oh, blast! It can't be! Oh. Not that nasal ninny! Yep, that nasal ninny! I figured it out, Pumpernickel, the answer to the very, very big riddle that will rid Frankfurt of the dragon. So, remember me? There is no dragon of Frankfurt. But, my lord, the riddle can't be solved. I mean, it's quite stu uh, uh, difficult. Takes years just to scrape up a clue, I hear. Ha-ha! <laughs> but not for King Clatsius. What opens and closes and has gobs of teeth? The answer was right under my nose. Why, it's my mouth! <laughs> Afraid not, my lord. You missed by a mile. <laughs> Better start questing again, sire. Oh, drat. I was so sure. <laughs> ah, oh. Ah, ha, ha. Oh, oh. Wait, your majesty. I have the answer. It's a zipper. Well... Bend my lords, that's it! Ha <laughs> ha! A zipper! What's a zipper? Well, there you are! No more Frankfurt Dragon! I guess that means we don't need a dragon wizard anymore, right, Pumpy, old boy? <laughs> Excuse me, your kingship? Remember me? We met at the lake? Oh, uh, yes, a tot! I owe you a favor for your chivalrous deed. Do you mind if I cash it in now? It has to do with Pumpernickel. Uh, what do you have in mind, Squire? Cheers to my new mascot, Stitches! Yes, and not a bad job. King's mascot. Wonder if he has any openings for a fool. I think the other important job is already filled, A.B. Baker or Pumpernickel Red. Oh, oh, I hate Pumpernickel. Oh, it's not so bad, Pumpy. Stay cool, guys. Maybe we'll drop in on you sometime. Now take care, Max. Let's try to end up in the right time this time. Relax, A.B. At time travel, I'm a past master. Oh, Max, haven't we had enough adventure for one day? Hang loose, A.B. Come on, Beethoven, baby. Let's jam. You make Mozart look like chopped liver! <laughs> <laughs> 